Trevor Harris. Um, I love MLK because without him I wouldn't have gotten a chance to have a black roommate, so give it up for him. But uh, yeah, now to transition to Mormons, oh this is going to be fun. But um, see all this empty space right here? These are all the girlfriends that Manti Teo set me up with. <laughs> Good, there are some Notre Dame people in here, thank God. But really, you guys pay attention to Notre Dame football. But uh, if you don't know the story, he said in September that his grandma died. And then six hours later, his girlfriend had leukemia. That's terrible, right? So he used that story to propel his whole season. He almost won the Heisman. And then he got his ass kicked by Bama, like 42 to 14 or 49 to 3, something like that. And I guess he couldn't handle the loss because the next thing he says a week later is, oh, yeah, my girlfriend, she was fake. I lied about her having cancer. Ugh, because my mom really has breast cancer, and she's, that's not cool, man. I don't like Mormons now. Oh, that's terrible. But, uh... Yeah, he's all like in his post-whatever post, post uh, whatever interview. He goes, you know what? She was the most real girl that I've ever been with. She was the most beautiful girl ever. And I'm not talking about her looks. I'm talking about her character. Oh, what a fucking fruitcake. But it's okay. I like gay people. You guys would never say anything like that. So don't worry about that. But uh, a buddy of mine, he was like, well, Trev, uh, what if he's gay? Uh, well, if he's gay, then I can't really root for him anymore. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. But, uh, geez, let's see. Oh, right. He continues in the interview, and he's like, you know what? She always told me to keep God first. You know, I've actually been told that, too, by some girl buds of mine. But here's the thing. I can actually call them up, and I can hug them, and it feels great. So, yeah, there you go. But I do... I am a huge hypocrite, hypocrite, guys, because here's the thing. I'm such a huge flirt that sometimes the girl that I'm going to be making laugh actually ends up being a cougar, and I have to call a girl bud because I think I'm going to get raped. And, uh, yeah, I can make people laugh that bad. And uh, she's like, hey, Trev, uh, you, you're calling me because you need another girlfriend, right? Yeah, well, okay. What I want you to do is I want you to tell her that I help you tie your shoes because you have cerebral palsy, and then when we're out with friends... That I help you tie your foot, cut your food. Really? Oh, okay. And I love it because I have a huge medical fetish because I'm majoring to cure cancer, and it kind of looks like this, right? Yeah. So I love watching you cut your food. But I gotta just hand it to Manti, guys. I gotta lay off him because he did set me up with the most beautiful girl in the world, and I'm not talking about her looks. I'm talking about her character, and she's dying of breast cancer actually no she's dead and she's somewhere <laughs> on the stage but i don't know where she is because she doesn't exist that's all i got i'm trevor <laughs>